Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today with a vlog this Friday night. I actually had another video planned for today, but I actually spent all my time editing an advertisement for my YouTube channel instead of editing that video. You're like an advertisement. Well, I've actually decided that I will now be overlaying a couple ads in the videos after my intro. Ads will not appear in vlog videos, in custom product reviews, and in other some certain videos, it kind of depends on the video, but I will be adding some ads just to help me continue to expand my YouTube channel so I can provide you better Lego content. That's really what it is here. Someday I'd love to get a better camera and just keep providing you better Lego content. So to do that, I just have to expand my YouTube channel and ads are certainly gonna help this out. The max time of ads are 15 seconds. So what will happen is the video will be here, a little bit like, hey Brick Lover 18 here, to what we're going to do today. My intro will roll up, which is 5 seconds, and then it will be a 15 second ad, just explain a company, and then I get right back into the video. I know this is going to be an inconvenience to some people, and you're, some people are really not going to like that, and that's really unfortunate, but it's something that I need to do. But I'd still like to hear your thoughts down below, like is this going to be a deal breaker for you watching my channel, or do you realize that I need to do these ads to continue to help support my channel? Let me know your thoughts down below. Here I, this week I got some Lego lights from my actual dollar store. These are Christmas lights for a little Christmas theme thing I plan to do in my city. The city. So that's pretty cool. I also got just another pack of these trans clear lights just for the rest of my city, like these buildings, for when they're not on sale. Um, I made this really awesome mock recently and it's actually a working Lego safe. This video will hopefully be out on Sunday. This is Friday now. That hopes to be out on Sunday. That is my goal. The Lego room is actually pretty much spotless right now except for some things here, some things there, and over here. I've had a lot of Brickling packages this week so that's why I have some other stuff. All my seasonal Halloween sets have been taken down and I've actually put up my birthday set for my birthday this week. I will be having a birthday party tomorrow which on Saturday. So that's cool, an award ceremony all day, and a year ago this weekend was actually BrickFet Ottawa. BrickFet Ottawa. So that was really cool, fortunately they didn't come to Ottawa this year, but that's okay. So that means I've had this sprue for a year now and I still haven't done a video on it, which makes me bad. I don't, I don't think I talked about this, but a couple weeks ago I did end up buying one of these bricks at like Costco, and I think it was like $22 or something like that. I don't know, it's a good deal, I kind of like it. Waste of money, good deal. At the same time, I'm conflicted. <laughs> I have like a whole bunch of Lego boxes right there, which is kind of cool. My video schedule, this is uh, September's, so it hasn't been erased yet. And so far, this is November's. As you can see, it is a little bare, but I'm working on that. I also did a review of this Lego article throughout the week, which is kind of cool. And I did a video on showing you my Christmas sets, which there's a bin there and the other bin's not in this room right now because I'm building them in the basement. Just all the Christmas sets that I have that I will be building this holiday season. Um, I also created a Brick Lover 18 app and then the prototype version is actually on the iOS app store and I'm not even kidding, it's a Brick Lover 18 app. I'm going to do a full video on the official release date, which is the 18th of November, which is actually my birthday. The app is so cool, I'm really happy with it, still working on it right now, you know, changing the layout a bit. But if you want to see what's going on with that app, you can download that with the link in the description below. And again, it is a prototype, so any feedback you have is really appreciated. And that's kind of it. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I will be doing a small ad roll right now, so you get to see what this ad is all about. So, check the ad out right now, and thanks everybody for watching. Display your favorite Lego products on these handmade Lego shells from Mana Crafting High. These shells come in a variety of shapes, sizes, color, and styles so you can get them custom made to fit your Lego needs. Visit the link below for more information and use the promo code BRICKLOVER10 off to save on your order. Thanks so much for watching this BRICKLOVER18 Lego video. If you enjoyed this video and you want to subscribe for all Lego all the time, click the subscribe brick and you'll subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more of our previously uploaded Lego YouTube videos, check the cards as there's a playlist there containing all all our videos. If you want to see more BrickLover18, head on over to BrickLover18.com where you'll find the links to our Twitter and our Instagram and our BrickLink. Before you go, don't forget to leave a like on this video as well as a comment. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already by clicking the subscribe brick. Thanks everybody for watching and I hope you have a great day.